He dies at the age of 82, the legendary Brazilian football player, or what we call here in America, soccer player, passes away after a battle with colon cancer, which left him hospitalized for a month to leave the beautiful game, a phrase he coined. Again, he was 82 years old following a period in the hospital after he had a tumor removed from his colon last year. The Brazilian is widely regarded as the greatest football player ever that had ever lived with an incredible career. Pele, the only player ever to have won the World Cup three times, including at just the age of 17. He posted on social media on his 82nd birthday on October 23rd when he was in good health. Pele was one of the most influential people of the 20th century and one of the first black global uh, celebrity stars, athletes of all time, one of the first. And there he is, uh, very tragic. There he is with his wife, so forth and so on. Um, you know, again, this guy... You know, he actually, his dad from Brazil, they were watching a game and they lost. He was upset with the World Cup. And then he goes, don't worry, dad, I'm going to win you one. And he actually won, uh, you know, again, the championship for his father. And then he won two other times. Uh, again, world renowned. He also worked for the UN. He was a pitch man. Uh, here is his daughter, uh, Callie is shared an emotional photo hugging her dad in the hospital days before his death. Uh, just tragic there. Pele pictured here on February 13th on Instagram has died at the age of 32, of course, with that terrible colon cancer. Uh, not good. Not good at all. There he is on Instagram with his daughter again. Uh, of course, uh, he, he was one of the greatest icons. Uh, phenomenal who started his career at the age of 15 at Santos in Brazil. So 15 years old in the 50s, I believe he won. Again, Pele weeps at the shoulders of the goalkeeper, uh, Gilmar dos Santos uh, Neves, after scoring two goals in the Brazilian 5-2 victory over Sweden in the final World Cup in Stockholm in 1958. Pele was just 17 years old at the time. Uh, again, he was an icon, just not for Brazil, but throughout the world. Uh, all there. Um, and it's just tragic. Very, very tragic for those that follow this stuff. Of course, guys, I just finished doing a video on the World Cup and the symbolism. Check it out. I'll have more information down below how the system is all set up. But anyway, all there. He won the championship 58, 1962, and 1970. Wow. So he was hitting uh, decades. He won in 50s, 60s, and 70s. All part of it. Um, all there. So there you go, guys. Just wanted to give you a little bit of information. Of course, when you make it in the big time, he also became uh, an ambassador for um, many among others in the UN. Here he is with the Security General Kafi in 1999. So of course he had his, you know, his thing. Uh, you know, many of these celebrities they get into all this stuff, and of course he was part of a lot of the the systems. Of course he he championed and he tried to help the poor but of course he was also a climatist as well so there you go just some information on Pele if you didn't know uh, of course this is the trending stream here on the trending stream I give you the top trending topics worldwide so don't miss out and again guys please please subscribe and click and hit that bell all right, I really would appreciate it. And of course, the man was known, renowned, the president, and even Sly Stallone. So there you go, guys. Please, uh, you know, again, hit the like button. Thanks again for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.